Hello, my name is Elizabeth Channer. I'm the designated lead and deputy head pastoral at Bancroft School, and I'd like to talk to you a little bit about pastoral care here. Modern childhood and adolescence are challenging and becoming increasingly complex, but in its essence, pastoral care is most effective and children flourish most when they feel happy, safe, and supported. We have lots of systems in place to ensure that we can provide that support. For me, there are three cornerstones to this. Firstly, values-based education and teaching children about healthy relationships and being the best version of themselves that they can be. Secondly, in order to be able to do that effectively, we need to know the child. This is about developing relationships between the child, their tutor and their teachers. And finally, the dialogue between child, home and school is essential. It fosters trust and ensures an ongoing positive relationship when the child needs our support most. The best thing about working in pastoral care is that it is actually a privilege to accompany a child on their journey through school. And whatever the bumps in the road, and there are some, we get to see the child transformed into a young adult who leaves us ready to make their contribution to wider society. And that is really special. Hello, my name's James Barr. I'm the Assistant Head Pastoral and I'm responsible for the junior section, that's years seven, eight and nine, or the thirds, removes and lower fourths, as we quite confusingly call it here at Bancroft's. When a child joins the school, they go into one of the four houses um, and the houses run from years seven to, all the way through to 13, but are split into a junior and a senior section. So the junior, there's a junior housemaster uh, for the first three years and a senior housemaster for the last four. What this means is you've got great continuity of care. The housemasters really get to know the pupils, they've had them and crucially had contact with their family for a really long time. And so they really get to understand what the pupils are about and get to know them and their families really well. Also within the house, each child gets, uh, goes into a tutor group of about 14 to 15 people. Uh, and it's this group that they'll spend a great deal of time with. So they'll register with them in the morning and afternoons. They will do PSH, uh, PSHE with them. And they'll also have sort of group discussions and tutor times too. And it's these groups where real friendships are forged. So between the housemaster and the tutor, the child really gets to be known, gets to be understood, and gets to flourish within that group. Whilst we hope their time at school will be a happy one for each pupil, sadly that's not always the case for everyone. And we're very proud at Bancroft's of the support structure we have in place. As well as the house staff, myself and the deputy head pastoral, we also have two school counsellors and an excellent school nurse, as well as a number of pupil-led initiatives which offer a great deal of support to any pupil who needs it. So at any point, there are a myriad of people looking out for and looking after each and every child, allowing them to feel valued, safe, supported and confident, and allowing them to flourish and make their very most of their time at school.